What's up, guys? It's David coming at you from Organic Prize Books with a first look at a reprint of an omnibus from Marvel. Today we are looking at the one, the only, the bullseye man. We're looking at Hawkeye, the omnibus by Matt Fraction. And let me tell you, uh, people, I remember when this one went on the whatnot uh, as a out of print and people definitely want to get this one. Uh, pretty thin omnibus. That's okay. You know what? I'm sure Matt Fraction spins a really good story with with Hawkeye, uh, with the uh, you know sniper from the Avengers, the human sniper. So let's go ahead and take a look. This is the standard cover. Here you go. The front, mm, spine, <clears throat> and the back. And then we got the DM right here. Very cool. Front, spine. And the back, nice. Uh, my pick for this one is gonna be the standard. I like this. This is classic. I love the background with the white, and then you got like the the uh, targets throughout the. Uh, I want to call it the design of the building, and then you him him and the arrow going through. Very cool. I thought that was very nice. I like it. I think it's a very abstract but very cool looking title or cover. This one's nice too. This one just goes hard, man. It goes hard. All right, let's take a look underneath. <clears throat> the dust jacket, we'll see. Oh, very cool. Just a bunch of targets for him to hit. I bet you, if you threw this book like this, just like, whoosh, just threw it up in the air, Hawkeye would just go, bah, 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 hit every single target on point, no misses, and then your book would be ruined because then he'd have arrows through it the whole time. But you know what? It would probably be worth more because Hawkeye shot arrows through it. So, there's my two cents. Awesome. Let's go ahead and uh, hit the target on this one. Let's look inside and see what's behind the bullseye. All right, guys, let's take a look at Hawkeye by my fraction. And love the color scheme on this, the purple and the like magenta makes it look so cool. And, you know, Hawkeye is definitely a Interesting character for the Avengers, because he's human, he's just a sniper marksman trained to the, like, absolute peak of human phys uh, physiology, and he's up there fighting gods, fighting mutants, fighting uh, super-powered beings with a bow and arrow and peak physical fitness, and it's great, like, just... Seeing that gives people hope. That's kind of why I like Batman, because it's like, he's a man, he's not a superhero. He, I mean, he's a superhero, but he's not a superhuman. He's just a person uh, using his brains, his brawn, and his money to fight crime. And Hawkeye uses his uh, incredible talent and marksmanship. Very cool. The art on this is very unique. I like it a lot. It looks really, really good. Uh, definitely for Hawkeye, it's different, but appreciate it. So let me tell you a little bit about this book. Everybody loves Hawkeye. And what's not to love? Clint Barton is the everyday, uh, everyman Avenger. The guy who brings a bow to a god fight. The roguish adventurer that men want to be and women want to be with. Except for Kate Bishop. She's firmly in the B camp. So much so she started slinging arrows of her own as the young Avenger, known, also known as Hawkeye. As for the be with, she knows the mess Clint made with his superhero ex-girlfriend and his superhero ex-wife. Not to mention the mess he's making with his superhero friend girl. Kate would rather have him as a mentor. Thank you very much. Far better being under Clint's wing than staying over at his place. So on the days that Ultron isn't destroying Manhattan, it's Hawkeye and Hawkeye against the world. Well, against problems like a hurricane, mysterious, mysterious mob maiden, Madame Mask, and the rascal tracksuit Draculus. They're gangster, not vampires, but they sure bite. They want Clint's new apartment building back, and they're not afraid to break your heart to get it, bro. Speaking of bros, Barney Barton is in town. That rarely ends well. Clint and Kate's friendship will be tested to the limit, and L.A. is calling her. L.A. is in Los Angeles. Maybe she'd be better off as a detective out west. Hawkeye, P.I., you'd watch that, right? Big question is, 
Who gets to keep Lucky, the, the pizza-munching, crime-busting, award-winning issue number 11 starring Wonder Dog? Matt Fraction, David Aja, and a giant quiver full of tricks artists tear up the rule book on superhero comics? Yes, that is the whole story told in American Sign Language. To deliver your new favorite title. Scratch that, your new favorite anything. Winner of four Eisner Awards, Best Artist 2013 uh, by David Aja, Best Cover Artist 2013 by David Aja, Best Cover Artist 2014, David Aja, Best Single Issue 2014, Hawkeye number 11. So you're definitely getting some great, amazing stories, award-winning stories. And a look at Hawkeye, uh, as you wouldn't see him with the Avengers, more of a, uh, you know, into his personal life, into his his uh, mentoring life for Kate Bishop and seeing her grow as well, you know, becoming not only mentoring under Hawkeye, but being her own person. So it's very cool seeing that, and, uh, you know, David Aja does a great job. This artwork looks amazing, and, you know, everybody agreed enough to f uh, win awards for it. I know this is a reprint, but people have definitely been looking for it, and if you're a fan of Hawkeye, you don't want to miss this. Hopefully you already have it. If not, it's the perfect time to pick it up. Let's see what extras are included in this. All right, nice. This is definitely the Hawkeye from, like, the Ultimate Avengers. <clears throat> okay, some of the uh, artist concepts and stuff like that for the covers, the page process right here. Very cool. Um, and some of the scripts for it, uh, layouts and stuff like that. The color on this, I love this like that. The coloring on it without the uh, edgings or the line work on it. Looks so cool. Oh! And then, look, David Osh has a playlist. So he has uh, what you should listen to while you read each of the issues. Hawkeye number one, number two, number three, all that. And, uh, you know, hopefully you're not too fast of a reader because these songs look like they take you like 20, you know? Yeah. 20 minutes to read or to listen to. I can finish a, a book or an issue in like five minutes. Ugh. But yeah, definitely check it out if you're a Hawkeye fan or if you want just a good story. I heard this one is really good. Um, check it out at Gunnick Price Books, guys, and I will see you in the next one.